I just got cut off on never get married. And so this is part two. And as I said before, um, my brother called the guy asking me some crazy shit about how to hook up Fortnite. They're going to be destroyed. They gonna, it might even take them years just to get really good at it. And they don't play no games. I'm just... I'm a, I'm prodigy from my brothers and sisters. I don't I'm just born differently. You know, it's all about genetics. Everything's about genetics, people. It's no longer is about human behavior. You gotta skip that. Skip that. Okay. If you don't know who I am, please read my description. I'm smarter than most of you. Overall, because I'm a Renaissance. I do not talk about one subject. I talk about multiple subjects. Though it may seem like um, I'm just talking for men's protections. Men's rights activist movement, MGTO, whatever, that's the trend right now, okay? You know, we got women trying to say they are always right and men are always wrong. So, now, I am an expert when it comes down to things because I have experience in the backbone. So, check my credential before you run amok. You can learn something from me, okay? Even though I'm a schizo, okay? Whatever. I don't care about how people view me on this YouTube Doxing would not work on my types. I'm magical, so be my guest. It only make me popular. Don't take words and flip them through because I'll be like, I didn't say that. I didn't mean to say it if I did say it, okay? Because I would say that. Okay? I didn't mean to say that. So you fix it. So since you put it out there, you fix that shit because I'm crazy, right? Well, we are talking about the values of marriage. The values of marriage is no longer. It's mainly used to... Take advantage of beta alphas and betas. Now these days, beta, now these days, betas are taking advantage of the matriarch, because um, beta alphas may not catch up to it because they always get, they always fuck with used vaginas. They're simp's. They're the biggest simp's. Beta alphas are the biggest simp's. Okay, because they'll never learn from their situation. So you'll have someone who constantly get hurt in marriage, but they'll keep coming back because they're trapped in the pussy, the, the lower frequency vibration. They're trapped with the pussy down there, right? So they don't know how to get out. So they keep getting hurt by a bitch instead of killing a bitch. Or, or, or as a matter of fact, they become an incel and kill someone else because okay? they can't control their sexual energy. It's harder for a man sexual. Men, men have it hard when it comes down to uh, knowing how to release that sexual energy. Women don't have that type of problem in general. Yes, we know this is a fact. But um, marriage is not beneficial. But if you take advantage of marriage, however, you become smarter than the average male. The smartest than the average beta or beta alpha male. Alphas tend to don't focus on the sexual aspect of any relationship. We don't focus on that. True alphas tell women and people indirectly, don't fuck with me. I will smack you right now. You spit, I will smack. You make a move, I will smack you. And then get in trouble and then track you down after you get out of jail. Because there's no hell spirit in a man scorn if he uses his brain. Okay, because he uses logic. Okay, duh. Okay, you know, men lose more logic. They use more logic than women. They can't win in the chess game. Every time I play a woman in chess, I always win. I'm like, because she's not thinking 10 steps ahead. Okay, I love chess. And I play without the motherfucking queen to beat your ass. Let's make this even here. I'm going to take out the chess. I'm going to see how many pieces I can take. And see how stupid you are. Okay, if I can take some, if I take this amount of pieces, then I won. Because that means my brain power is moving a little bit more than yours. And you have the queen. How the fuck is that possible? You have the motherfucking queen. I took my queen out and I took half of your pieces. Think how logical that is. But women, all they need to do is run to white daddy. But the white daddy actually helps men both ways. So you got to think like this. So it really doesn't matter. See, I didn't lose. I got divorced from my wife. But I allowed my wife. I got custody of my kids too because I'm not stupid, okay? Because I learn as I go along too. Because sometimes when you have ignorance, you get blessings in disguise. But you have to understand one thing. If you allow your your companion or something to do some evil and you spoke what's going to happen, then you have a power. I've been doing this all my life. I speak about something that will happen in advance because I'm a prophet. <clears throat> okay. And then when that bad thing does happen, then, of course, they, it's most likely to happen. And then they, they start to believe. But somehow it doesn't stick in their head. So I don't really have to worry about that. Now my wife pays me and shit and I got custody and shit and I ain't got to worry about that shit. Now it's up to you guys to understand that if you do or if you are married, your chances of getting out is as soon as possible. Okay, as soon as possible. Get out of that marriage. She's not happy with you. Take her property. Go to court. You have to take the initiative. 
Like I allow, I took the initiative to get a divorce, so I don't have to worry about none of that other bullshit that goes along with it. Because I'm smart, and I told my wife, I said, if you just set this up right, we can have a mansion in the house easily. But remember this: if you are married and you got your wife's name on the lease and all that other bullshit, and you didn't sign no prenup, you've been duped, motherfucker. You've been duped. The true pimps of the '80s, from where I was raised up, will say you've been duped. And probably some of that money's going towards a pimp. You gotta watch that shit now. You guys who are married, some of that money's probably going towards her pimp. And you don't know who her pimp is. It's secret. Women are clever at hiding secrets and, and affairs. They're successful at liars and being manipulative of overall. Like I said before, I don't hate on the game, but you gotta take advantage of the game. Men play both sides of the fence while women play one side of the fence. And the only way to win is to analyze what you have in front of you. You have to make sure you psychoanalyze that shit. Women don't have the time to, to play a hard video game. They don't have the time to be playing RPGs and uh, loads of different type of genres of games. They play Candy Crush. Remember why you think we have Candy Crush, motherfuckers? We have, like, I'm playing Candy Crush. Like, Look at this cool ass game. It's colorful, but there's no substance in it. There's no substance in Candy Crush, motherfucker. But me, my advantage is that I hear a voice that talks to me and tells me what to do. While well, you guys don't hear anything. So you're not indigo children. When you come, when you become 30, you just don't become indigo child. There's a lot of stupid people out there. <laughs> Ignorant, ignoramus people. There's even some scholars out there who I talk to and they think mathematics is the equation of everything. <laughs> so when I talk to the asses, I'm like, don't you think it's possible that mathematics may not be the solution to everything and you can use mathematics in every dimension, time, and space? You, do you think that? And they'll be like, yeah. I'm like, okay. Now I know to stay away from your ass, okay? But other than that, let's kind of digress here. Marriage is a tool. It's used for women, okay? This is why I say never marry. It's used for women. When women are... Are, are struggling to keep up with men in their intellectual ways, yada, 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 because men and women are equal. Even black and white men are not the same. Nobody's the same, and nobody should be getting equal pay and all that because everybody does different things. Okay, you know, some people work harder, so they get paid more, so they can see you, they recognize you. When you pay, get paid less or they don't like you, something you didn't do to the manager or whatever, yada, yada, yada. Women sleep with their bosses. Women make, they have shortcuts in colleges. That rhymed. That rhymed. They sleep with their bosses and they have shortcuts in colleges. Y'all don't know about that shit. Yo, nobody talking about that shit. Come on, man. Anywhere you see a document where it's saying men are doing this more than women, I'm like, that's up for debate because I don't even agree with that. That's not even common sense. Now, don't get me wrong. There are some women who can beat men at their game. Very rarely. Okay? It's just rare. Dama doesn't. No waltz you want to call. I even talked to a couple uh, no waltz in this country, in the United States, the biggest whore of Babylon. Okay? I've talked to some females who have fire conversations just like me. But that's rare. Out of fucking 100 women I've talked to, over 100 women, I see only 10. Okay, but um, other than that, that's all I really wanted to say about marriage. Okay, you guys got to start thinking about the leverage on that shit. Don't get married. Collision is key. Verbal agreements are better than fucking marriage. Okay, because I'm like, yo, you want to force me to get married to you now, bitch. Okay, I seen basketball players cry and shit and trick the bitch up. Okay, black black guys don't usually get married for a good reason because they don't. For, number one, they're only thirteen percent of the population. And white guys keep doing this shit, so I got more work to do. So many simps, so little time. I got a whole lot of work to do, guys. Just keep in touch. I'm, I'm, I'm just disappointed. But I know there's a trend going on. You know, guys are starting to wake up a bit. I'm disappointed in the past, though. Because I'm thinking, I'm thinking that the pimps has been on the street for eons. They've been on the streets for eons of time. But nobody listens to them because pimping ain't easy. But simping is. Simping is easy. Wow. And a lot of people don't even know what simping means. Okay? They just think simping is putting a mediocre woman. That's not a mediocre woman. That's a mediocre pussy. She's used, so you already a simp. Sorry. Once she says she's not a virgin, you, you start dibbling and dabbling in that, you a simp. It's that simple. 
Start traveling. Go get somewhere polygyny. And guys, monogamy is a simp. All right, I just... Don't get me wrong. When I was younger, when I was blue pill, I didn't know shit. When I was 17 and 16, I talked to pimps and I thought, oh, they're full of shit. Everybody goes through some bull, some fucking blue pill. I was even a blue pimp. You know, a blue, blue, a blue, blue simp a little bit. I was like simping for the bus, but I never got any gas. Lucky for me, <laughs> I didn't catch no diseases. Lucky for me, I didn't have no kids. I got my kids when I was 31 years old, when I lost my virginity. How about them apples? All right, so lucky for me, they rejected me so much to where I was like, oh, okay, okay, I'm going to fuck these bitches with strap-ons, and I got a chance to see a lot of pussy more than you guys have. Yes, I have. I've been in two menage twice, but I got my dick sucked a couple times, and I even met a female who just liked it nothing but dick sucking. But other than that, y'all guys are different from me. I guess we are different, okay? <laughs> I got paid for my services. What did you get paid? Uh, uh, right, right. You paid money for pussy? I'm like, motherfucker, are you out of your mind? Now, don't get me wrong. You know, when I was in my t early 20s, I used to take women out. I used to take them to Red Lobster. Sure. And I would be expecting something in return. But I'm like, damn, I only did it a few times. And then I just like, there's a fuck, there's something wrong with these bitches. And they think I'm going to take them and spend $50, $25 on my plate, $25 on their plate. And I'm going to keep doing it shit? No. <laughs> you know, I was simping a little bit too. I'm going to be honest about it. Simping also means catering, okay? But you can't be doing that if you if you are you are a definite simp if you are with a woman, and she you don't know her background you don't care if she's a virgin or not you are definitely a simp, you are a simp to a level ten right there, and then I keep talking motherfucker simp I said I'm not simp I said well tell me something okay did you lick a use pussy before, you know yada 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 okay? you didn't get mad at me don't get mad at me I just said it like it is this is how it is. Now, you can transform yourself from that. But that's all I really wanted to say. And I'm going to get me some, I'm going to get me my smoothie now, you guys. Marriage is forbidden. Stop it. Never get married unless you've got a plan for the master plan. Okay? I hope you learned something here. Kadoodles. Skedoodles. And. I'm not your average man. I'm not your Peter Pan. Peace.